Okay, tell me your name. My name is Terry Easley. I am Ajay Dev's sister-in-law and sister of Peggy, older sister of Peggy Dev. Um, so tell me what brings you out today. Well, there's been a grave injustice. Um, Ajay Dev, 378 years. Um, I personally uh, was involved with the family at the time when the, uh, supposedly the accusations took place and, and have been through this whole process, have gone through the court records and, and um, all of that, and I know that there's just been a huge injustice, and I think the only way that we're going to right this is, is, by, is by continually fighting, no matter how long it takes. So, so I'm here in the trenches for however long it takes. So why do you think um, he didn't do it? Well, there's, there's a few reasons, really. Um, initially, when I first heard about the charges, and uh, my reasons were different. They're a little bit different now, after having been exposed to the case and really delved into the case, looked at the evidence, looked at the facts. Um, initially, my, res my, my feeling was, was because, like I said, I was involved with the family I knew. I knew the issues that they were having. I was well aware of that. Um, and I knew the timeline, the sequence of events that had happened. And, and it, her, her story was just so fantastic. And there were just too many things too many things that just didn't make sense and like I said having been involved and then once once the actual trial happened then taking a, a personal interest in it looking at all of the evidence pouring over 10,000 pages all everything and looking at the case that they had seeing what evidence they had and saw the great lengths of what they went to in order to convict him it, it just really really cemented in my mind that they put away an innocent man. What do you want the public to know about Ajay Dev? I, I really wish they could know him personally. Um, I think that if Ajay had a chance to speak from his own heart and had a chance to speak to the public, I think that they would, I, I think that they could see what type of person he was. And I think that's the hard thing right now. That's missing. I wish. I, I really wish there was a way that that the people could actually speak to him or hear him speak. Okay. Thank you.